Prince Harry, isolated Duke's birthday plans sparked questions over who he partied with. Prince Harry just celebrated his 36th birthday in his new Californian home, but royal watchers have been wondering who he chose to honor the occasion with. Harry and Meghan have settled in a lavish mansion in Santa Barbara, with their son Archie Harrison. While coronavirus restrictions mean any gatherings with individuals outside of your own household are not permitted in the coastal city, Harry is likely to have reached out to friends and family to celebrate his birthday last week. It has been reported that he had a video call with his royal side of the family, which Prince William opted out of, according to some sources, due to other commitments. The Duke of Sussex may have commemorated the day with some of his new friends in California, although he and Meghan have kept their new social lives far away from the public eye. Questions over Harry's new friends have been circling for months now, especially after royal biographer Penny Jr. claimed he had isolated himself from his loyal supporters since moving to the other side of the Atlantic. The Daily Mail claimed Harry was surrounded on all sides by Team Meghan back in May. The Duchess of Sussex's inner circle included her friends such as Benita Litt, Heather Dorak, and Abigail Spencer, as well as global tennis star Serena Williams. Shane Watson also speculated last week that activist Gloria Steinem, who recently appeared in a video chat with Meghan to discuss women's right to vote, would have made the cut in any birthday celebration. She suggested that Glenn and Doyle and her wife Abby Wambach would have made an appearance, too, and explained in The Telegraph, the Sussexes have said they adore mental health guru Doyle. David Foster, the Canadian songwriter and producer was also tipped to be the designated party organizer for the Duke of Sussex, according to reports from August. Harry has allegedly adopted a father and son-like relationship with the musician over recent months. These claims emerged after Catherine McPhee said her husband, Mr. Foster, has a really, really beautiful relationship with Harry back in May. The couple's new neighbor, Oprah Winfrey would have sent her birthday wishes to the Duke of Sussex as well, according to Ms. Watson. She added that Elton John would probably have made an appearance, too, as he is known to have a tight-knit friendship with Harry. Ms. Watson also claimed Sir Elton would have been invited because he's a neighbor and is said to have introduced the Sussexes to their house finder Martin Lawrence Bullard. She added, also Elton is the go-to celebrity for square-shouldered support when your life hits turbulence. Ms. Watson then wondered if James and Julia Corden would have been invited, as well as Vicky Charles who was the interior designer of Frogmore Cottage. Amala and George Clooney may have made an appearance too, especially considering they were both invited to the Sussex's 2018 wedding. However, it's not known if Harry would have been in contact with any of his friends who live in the UK. It's thought that Harry has drifted from close friends such as the old Tony and Tom and Skip ever since his wedding, and, as Ms. Watson's piece explained, this year was very different for the royal.